With the World Cup in Messi's hands, I'll be rated the best goalkeepers at the World Cup and providing you some awesome stats and the best saves produced. With 32 teams within the competition and lots of goalkeepers, Emiliano Martinez has won the best goalkeeper award from the World Cup. However, here are some fun stats. Tunisia conceded the least amount of goals within the tournament with only one, beating finalists France and losing 1-0 to the Socceroos. On to the not so fun statistic for Costa Rica and Keylor Navas. They are crowned to be the nation who have conceded the most amount of goals with 11, something to forget about. There have been 9 nations that have had the least amount of clean sheets, such as Germany, Qatar, Wales and more. And the most consecutive clean sheets has been awarded to Jordan Pickford with England with only 3. Morocco has achieved the most amount of clean sheets with only 4, with Martinez, Bono and Pickford getting the most amount of clean sheets individually with 3 each. Wayne Hennessy was the only goalkeeper to be awarded a card during this tournament and it was a red card. This tournament was filled with many heroics and lots of man the match awards to goalkeepers. Jan Sommer, Ochoa, Gonda, Epesi, Mohamed Al Awais were all goalkeepers which have been awarded one man the match award. However, Bono and Levakovic have both gained two man the match awards throughout this tournament. Dominic Levakovic has managed to gain the most amount of penalty shootout saves within this tournament and also has managed to gain the most amount of saves in this tournament with 25 shortly followed by Strzezny with 23. Levakovic has also made the most amount of saves within a single match counting up to 11 against Brazil. Also Levakovic has managed to get the highest amount of goals prevented with an XG of 3.5 and surprisingly Martinez is on the other side of the spectrum, gaining the least amount of XG of minus 2.6. Ibrahim Danlad is the youngest goalkeeper at the tournament of the age of 19. However, the polar opposite is Mexican goalkeeper Alfredo Tavalera with the age of 40 years of age. Here were some of the stats for the World Cup. However, now I'm going to give you my ratings of the best goalkeepers in the World Cup. We will rate these goalkeepers on a scale out of 10 basing their performances within the World Cup. Starting with the World Cup legend Ochoa. Ochoa only played 3 matches throughout this tournament and saving the penalty against Lewandowski and gaining the man of the match award against Poland. Ochoa played really well, only could see 3 goals, therefore he gets a 6. Lower than what you expected? Tell me what you would put down in the comments. Next goalkeeper to rate is Thibaut Courtois. The Golden Glove winner, but this wasn't really the best tournament he has played. Conceding only two goals, he didn't look as sharp as he usually does. Yes, he played one really good game against Croatia, but one game doesn't define his tournament's performance. Seemed sloppy at times and sometimes just making his decision too quick, therefore I'm giving him a free. Szczesny had an awesome tournament, producing multiple great saves and a lot of saves which he shouldn't have made. Considering he only played 4 games and he's made the second most amount of saves within the tournament, he can only blame his team for that. Making probably the save of the tournament, he was solid, he deserves a high rating of 9. He made 2 penalty saves, leaving him with a 100% penalty save record, 1 penalty save against Messi and the most amount of saves with the lesser games played. I think the stats speak for themselves. Eh? Neuer was as solid as a rock, especially with that one-handed save from a few meters out. But this wasn't his best World Cup performance, so he's getting a 5. Bono for Morocco was incredible. Although he had to come off the pitch early after he sang the anthem due to an eye problem, he was able to play the rest of the tournament perfectly fine. Bono only conceded one goal until he faced France in the semi-finals. Bono gets a 9. Levakovic is the goalkeeper who have knocked out Brazil, Croatia and Japan out of this tournament. Yes, he may have conceded more goals, however he has the best stats out of any goalkeepers within this tournament. Levakovic gets a 9. 10 is only for perfect performances and as we all know, we are all human, there's not going to be a perfect performance. Yet. Martinez, the same goalkeeper to celebrate the best goalkeeper award like this. He gets an 8 from me. Whoa, 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 an 8. Yes, I don't believe he's played that well. I know he's made crucial saves during the times when Argentina needed him the most. That means in the 
final against France. But I believe Levakovic, Bono and Szczesny have played all better than them. Personally, Martinez was great, but he wasn't that good as Liva or Bono, because they showed different class throughout this tournament. Lloris gets an 8, Pickford gets a 7, Simon gets a 5, Navas got 2, poor Kato Navas. Well, we are getting bored of these ratings. So, here are the best saves produced at this World Cup. Unbelievable display of goalkeeping. But here's the polar opposite. Tough watch. If you agree or disagree with my list, then write it down in the comment section below and write your save if you got to this bit of the video. But other than that, 